I mean, I was a beast. I mean, I wasn't scared of anything. Uh, uh, I mean, if, if I got hit, I'm getting back up. And for some reason, every time I got hit, I got more aggressive. But this one time I got hit so hard, uh, I didn't know my name. Matter of fact, they went to the game to the sideline and they made me down to 10. They says, well, where are you playing? And I said, uh, well, I'm in, uh, I'm in Los Angeles. And I was in Georgia. So I knew then that was, that day was over for me. And I mean, I probably had more concussions than just the ones I knew of, but I probably had several of them. I, I, you know, you hear, you hear stories now about guys having eight, nine, 10 concussions. I mean, how do you perform with those type of injuries? What I noticed uh, my post football career, that I was having issues with memory. I was on the 405 freeway one day and I blanked out. And I don't know how I ended up on the side of the road, on the shoulder side, because if I don't went to the left versus the right, I'm not sitting here. So I arranged an appointment to see Dr. Amen. And we, he interviewed me, asked me how many concussions I thought I had. I said, I believe I had three, but now that I know I've had, I had more. So uh, he scanned my brain. And what I found out was that I was pre-Alzheimer's. I was headed for that, according to the diagnosis. And I realized that if I don't stay on top of this and stay religiously to the program, it was gonna be continuing deterioration of my brain. So uh, he subsequently put me on a, on, a, on a program and I've been doing it ever since. And I remember one day, uh, 2017 I was here and, and doctor I was getting my brain scan and Dr. Amen uh, saw my, my results after 10 years before and he, he was like a kid in a candy shop jumping around because he saw so much improvement of where my brain was going. My recall was better, uh, my, my comprehension of everything was better. And at first when I was on the program I thought it was a hokey pokey kind of thing. Hey, there's no way because once you have brain damage there's no reversal. That's what I always thought. And now I was educated here at the clinic that it, it, it can happen. 